I see. In that case, I want to give her as little time alone as possible. Uh, I don't want to bathe with her, all right? I know. You're a boy and all. For her baths, we can send Bienfu. No, that's a bad idea. It'll have to be Mogulu. Or myself. Phew! What sort of boundaries have you and Eleanor drawn? How do you sleep? We talk before bed sometimes. But it's not like I'm sleeping by her side or anything. It's easier for me to tell when she wakes up if I'm dwelling inside her. Does she ever get out of bed at night? Not in my experience. And she sleeps so peacefully. Huh? When she's around you guys, she always looks so stern. But when she's sleeping, her expression is... softer, you could say. She lets her hair down, too. And I think it's kind of prettier that way. Huh. So that's what he likes. Well, keep an eye on her, but... But? Watch out for the older girls. Huh? Teresa and Oscar sure seem close. I've known them since I was an initiate, but I've never seen them quarrel, not even once. Did you ever fight with your brother, Velvet? Yeah, I guess I did. Sometimes I'd chew him out, and he'd sulk and stop talking to me, but I found that adorable too. You did? No matter how much he dug in his heels, or tried to talk like he was in charge, after a while he'd be right there trailing along behind me. Like a little puppy dog. Puppies are a lot more obedient. I always had to keep an eye on him. Little brothers are odd creatures. Rokuro's a little brother. Is he adorable too? Huh? I don't think a little brother who's out to kill you is in any way adorable. But Chigure seemed like he was having fun. Sometimes you just don't make sense. Huh? I don't know. <laughs> little brothers. Do you have any siblings? I'm an only child. Well, then, that's perfect. You pretend the boy is your little brother. Huh? That's a bit extreme. But actually, when I'm talking with Lavi Set, sometimes I think this is what having a brother must feel like. I could be Eleanor's brother. Don't take any of this nonsense seriously, Lafi Set. Malakim are just tools to exorcists. She can never think of you as her brother. Oh, yeah. You're wrong. I've changed how I view Malakim. I know that's true because I can think of him as a brother. Right. She's all talk. Don't believe her. <laughs> it seems to me like you're the one who's treating him as a tool by forcing your own opinions upon him. You want a battle? Two sisters struggling for the affections of their brother. Amy, teeny, candlestick. Which one will the mom pick? How about an older brother instead? Ah, oh, that's fun. Well, let's go this way. For things and items and such. Hey, this doll? It looks like Bienfu. Ah, a keen eye you have, young man. That is a doll of the Empyrean Amenoch. That's... Empyrean Amenoch? Yep, no doubt about it. I've seen her with my own eyes. Real dignified, but not without a bit of a temper. You saw her? Why was she angry? Well, the Abbeys banned any profession of the Amenochian faith in Southgand, despite her popularity. Gotta assume that's what got her all bent out of shape. I tried talking to her, but no matter what I said, she was just like... <sighs> oh. Wait, that sounds like... And that low-energy goddess you saw? The doll you've got here looks like her? Yeah, more or less. Ha! Fortune smiles upon thee, weary adventurers. That listless goddess is none other than Grim. Grimoire isn't human? When did I ever say she was? So, shopkeep, where'd you see her? I think it was down by McClear Beach. Pensively watching the tide come in? That's her, all right. Quickly, to the beach! <sighs> Why didn't you mention Grimoire as a Moloch before now? You can't be too careful with that information. Spies, spies listening everywhere! <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Hmm. 
It's hmm. better. Uh. Hmm. I would keep it like it is. It boosted kind of much though. Holy shit. Oh shit, I forgot to put that on. Should do. How do I get to the beach in them? I ain't gonna worry about that guy. That random exclamation point. We were gonna check it out, but whatever. I want to see the beach. <laughs> Who's this sparkling over here? Get sage. Birdies. Alright, they get out here. They go to the beach, damn it. Keep getting sidetracked by random shit.
will need to be extremely wary. That damage, man. Just looks so nasty. Oh my god. Jesus. That damn food was just rude. That button don't work too well on my controller. The block button.
This grimoire we were searching for is a Moloch like Bienfu, right? To be honest, I don't see how someone so different can be a Moloch just the same as Lafie said or Isa. I understand your doubts. It's quite the tangly mess. I'll tell you anything! In that case, I've been wondering, what's underneath your hat? Oh no! Anything but that! So, we've hit a wall already. <laughs> <laughs> with you all right is there anything you can tell me i could talk about what type of malachim we are or our position in the world of malachim or our abilities oh i'd like to know all that then i will tell you listen closely we norman are a well-established race of malachim compared to other malachim we are just adapted As a convenient power up. They're also known as common spirits. Don't even say that! We Norman hate that. Why is it so painful for you? Because it makes people think you're average and unremarkable. That's why we work so hard to show how we're all different. That does explain your quirky speaking mannerisms. Don't spread it. That's a perfectly common thing to worry about. <laughs> 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 Expedition return. Oh shit. I don't even know what that means, but it sounds good. Scout ship settings. We've been having too much problem fighting wise in a while. But we ain't fought nothing super hard either, so. <laughs> <laughs> 